I would really want to take this opportunity to thank you very much and assure you, by the grace of God, you have shown us goodwill. You have come to us when we are down, when we are up. We will never forget you. <laughs> I want to thank you for the donation of food worth one million. We want, and the education team, we want some of this food to go to the schools. If we can feed our children in the schools, then we'll be, have given their parents a lot of peace of heart and mind. So some of this food, as we look at the vulnerable families, we are also going to give the food to the schools and make sure our young people are well taken care of. Because some of them are not going to school because there is no, there's no food. So thank you so much for your contribution and God bless you. Thank you. Thank you. I know maybe our short-term program is to feed our people now before the rains, the rains come. We cannot afford to have our people die because of lack of food. That is why we called you to come and join us uh, in this noble cause of trying to feed our people. But our long-term and our immediate goals are very clear. This Friday, we are giving 1,500 farmers in every ward seeds. So when the rain comes, we are able at least to grow our own food. And we are looking at the seedlings or the food that can grow within the short rains. We have worked through that with our agriculture team. And we are sure whatever seeds we are going to plant during this season, by the grace of God, we will harvest something. Rains belong to God, they don't belong to us. So we have long-term solutions.